Hello everyone, welcome to Cryptopreneur. Mexico could soon follow in the footsteps of El Salvador in legalizing Bitcoin as legal tender if a proposed bill passes the Senate. Mexican Senator for the state of Nuevo Leon, Indira Kempis, has stated that she wants to meet the country's second after El Salvador to adopt Bitcoin. However, the chances of this actually happening are slim at best. Speaking to local media this week, she noted that she aims to promote the use of Bitcoin in the country and use her political position to achieve that goal. We need Bitcoin to be legal tender in Mexico because if it is not so, if we do not make that decision as El, as El Salvador did, it is very difficult to take action. During the interview with Dario El Salvador, she added that El Salvador is undoubtedly becoming the most important hub or laboratory in the world about the future with Bitcoin. She commented on the problems of financial exclusion and the unbanked, citing cryptocurrency as a viable solution. It is clear to me that financial exclusion is one of the public problems that few of us have, a, have addressed with feasible alternatives and that this type of technology is allowing us to generate an alternative, a way, a solution so that millions of people can be included in the financial system. Kempis, working on a legal framework for cryptocurrencies, continued to emphasize the need for a legislation that would allow Bitcoin to be used as a currency. She intends to introduce a bill proposing such in the current parliamentary session. The initiative could be an uphill struggle, however. Last year, Mexico President Andres Manuel López Obrador said his government is not interested in Bitcoin adoption and is more concerned with tax evasion. His term ends in 2024, so there could be a long wait for Kempis. The central bank also plans to roll out a digital peso by 2024, as reported by Crypto Potato. Mexico's third richest man, Ricardo Salinas Pliego, thinks otherwise and has doubled down on previous Bitcoin statements. Over the weekend, he tweeted, You have to buy Bitcoin. Keep buying when the price is low. Then just hold your Bitcoin. Forget about selling. Trust me, you're going to thank me later. El Salvador's adoption of Bitcoin has had a mixed reaction, however. It was recently reported that there had been a lot of demand for its BTC bonds. According to Blockstream's Samson Mao, who is backing the effort, the Bitcoin bonds have already got $500 million in verbal commitments. This is halfway to hitting the $1 billion target in less than four months.